I mean one. You don't have to mute it. Oh, I didn't mute it. I, I muted it. Oh. I'm so excited for this. We'll eat after you're open. That'll be like 8 o'clock. So oh my god, in. there's only two M&M's in this candy. Yeah, I've got three. I have four. Here. I don't know. Okay. Right. Previously, Previously on Life is Strange Before the Storm. I can't believe Firewalk is playing a show at the old mill. I'm gonna teach this little punk some manners. Hey! Dickhead! Get the it's fuck so out of here! Between your grades and your disregard for my rules, I see you slipping. I'm worried. We don't have to like each other, but you will respect me. Hello, Black Owl. Chloe, do something! Hey, do you know if Rachel is a gamer? How would you like to join me on a little field trip? Don't be surprised, Chloe. If one day, so this is what, the I'm just out Let me know if you need an accomplice. Damn, they are really going at it. You remember that guy that we saw under this tree with that woman? That was my dad. That was not my mom. And that woman was definitely not my mom. I hear you, Rachel Amber. Miss Price, how good of you to join us. I'm so sorry we're late. My, my shift ran late at the diner and then we're just sorry. Let us proceed. One of you here is new to the Blackwell disciplinary process. And the other is all too familiar with it. Blackwell's code of conduct is built upon a foundation of mutual respect meant to foster an environment conducive to education and enrichment. When that respect okay. is violated... reality check time. Yesterday did actually happen. I ditched school with Rachel Amber, and then Rachel really did start that fire. And that was after we actually agreed to run away from here. Right? Are you paying attention to me, Chloe? Um, what? Miss Price, the last time we met, an agreement was brokered. Do you recall what that was? Screw up. Uh, don't get in trouble again. Trouble is merely the byproduct, Miss Price. What's at issue is your attitude. No more we agreed that like you would packs. rededicate yourself to becoming an exemplary Blackwell citizen. Do you want to No. We did. In the event that you were unable or unwilling to do so, we also agreed that it would become pertinent to reassess your future status at the Shit. academy. Despite okay. all this, you engaged in the following actions yesterday. Insubordinate language. Sorry. Disregarding posted signs about trespassing on the stage. Sorry, I did stand on the stage. Implications of possible drug-related activities. What does no, that mean? Yes, what does that mean? It means Miss Price has developed a reputation as a user of marijuana. And I would strongly recommend you take a she careful look through her room at down. home. <laughs> Shall I continue? Attempting to sabotage the academic goals of one of our top students. <laughs> oh, please. Victoria Chase. Oh, I yeah. see. That's true. That scared me. Fuck that. You want me to expel? You're fucking joking, right? Victoria tried to cheat off me, and I stopped her. You should be thanking me. I think what my daughter is trying to say... Miss Price can speak for herself, as she often does to her detriment. For her plagiarism, Miss Chase might have been suspended. 
might have. If Mr. Prescott, Nathan Prescott, hadn't spoken to me on Victoria's behalf. And we have witnesses saying Miss Price was also involved in a bullying incident of the same Mr. Prescott. <sighs> the hell I was. I stood up for that little weirdo. I suppose that's one interpretation of events. Say what you will about my daughter, but she is not a bully. Maybe you should be talking to Drew instead of me. You know, the guy who actually did what you're accusing me of. Mr. North's situation requires sensitivity. It will be handled separately. And Chloe's situation is less sensitive? I do not discuss other students' situations. We are here to discuss your daughter and her actions. Convenient. Mm -hmm. Mom. Mom. Yeah. Mom, you know this is all bullshit, right? I'm beginning to suspect that myself. I am sorry you feel that way, but your daughter's misbehavior is real and serious. And yet, even with your prodigious disciplinary record, Miss Price, we needn't discuss any of it. We needn't? No, because you severed your relationship with Blackwell the minute you left school grounds without permission. Cool. Ideally, I would like to be out of here by 10 o'clock. Probably we'll leave here around 5.36. What does that mean? It means... He forced my hand. This is a consequence of your actions, Chloe. I have no choice I but to... <laughs> What? Thank what? You, what? Amber. what? Yesterday was all me. My idea. I was having a bad day. I needed to blow off some dad. steam, and I took it too far. Chloe tried to talk me out of it. I've been down that road, she told me. You're better than this. But I wouldn't listen. See, Chloe was afraid I'd get in trouble or hurt, so she came with me. But only to keep me safe. <laughs> what the heck? I'm just sorry you got caught up in it, Chloe. That you allowed me to drag you down to my level. Can you forgive me? Of course. Of course I can. Yeah, sure. We're cool. Thank you. I'll make it up to you. I promise. Chloe, is this true? It's true. Totally not true. She really is an amazing actress. Miss Price? Yeah, fine. Fine, yes. It was her idea, but it's not like she kidnapped me. We were in it together. Miss Amber, based on what you've just told me, I have grounds to punish you. Are you sure what you've told me is the truth? Yes. This can't be the full story, Rachel. Ray! Just to be clear, Miss Amber, you're sure Chloe Price didn't coerce you, or... Coerce her? I'm just trying to get to the bottom of why someone like Rachel... Oh, I think we're clear, Principal Wells. Someone like Rachel, but not my daughter. Shit. Excuse me? Do you have a list of students you assume the worst about? Enjoy the show. <laughs> Go, Mom. You have no right to treat Chloe this way. Mm -hmm. This is because she's on financial aid, isn't it? <gasps> he calls us high risks. High risks? What kind of a label is that to put on a child? Oh, <laughs> I get it. This is about Blackwell's money troubles. Will you be dragging every other scholarship student into your office today as well? Tell me, will unfounded rumors about drug use also be mentioned, or is that only reserved for my daughter? My daughter. Damn. 
Let's all just calm down. After everything we... She's been through in the last two years. You yeah, should be ashamed died. of yourself. Miss you Price. Easy on Chloe. Mrs. Mm -hmm. Price. Mrs. Price. I appreciate your position, but I assure you, it is only your daughter's past behavior that has led us here today. I understand, Mr. Wells. There is no doubt that Chloe's behavior must improve. But given what we've just learned about the negative influence she was under, I hope you will allow her just one more chance. Miss Amber, I am as surprised as I am disappointed in you. I understand. This being your first infraction in no way reduces its severity. Still, we will not be suspending you at this time. But you have squandered our trust. You will no longer be my administrative assistant first period. Uh -oh. And you will no longer be involved in Blackwell's performance of The Tempest. <gasps> oh no. No. <sighs> cool, find a better Tempest. Are you insane? The performance is tonight. What? Are you insane? Are you insane? Your discipline is still pending, Miss Price. Ray, she loves that show. Since this is her first infraction, Mr. Don't you Amber, think, uh... I don't tell you how to run the district attorney's office. Please don't tell me how to run my school. There's a reason we have understudies for all circumstances, accidental and deliberate. I'm sure your understudy. Victoria Chase. How fitting. Yes, I'm sure Victoria Chase will do fine. That is such... What was that, Miss Price? <sighs> Chloe oh, is upset for her friend, but we are both grateful that she is not going to be unduly blamed for what happened. There is plenty of blame to go around. Chloe's future at Blackwell will be discussed next, unless you had something to add first, Miss Price. I got a fist to put right up your ass. Take, take the blame. blame. Belongs Rachel. Take the blame. I want to take the blame. No way is Rachel missing the play for me. Yes. But thanks to her acting skills, I'll have to go down in flames if I want to fix this. Oh boy. You gotta help me with this, Amanda. Oh god, I'll try. Get your head out of your ass, Wells. Chloe! <laughs> you seriously think yesterday was a little Miss Sunshine's idea? Miss Amber has accepted her responsibility. You're punishing her for taking the blame for me? For trying to be a good person? That makes you even more clueless than I thought. Rachel confessed. Are you calling her a liar? I confess she can act. Yes. I confess to thinking she can act like a motherfucker. You just <laughs> bought her crap. Hook? Line and sinker. You don't have to do this. It's okay. Really. Don't tell me what to do. I'm not one of your sycophants. I'm a lone wolf, and you're a little red riding hood. Welcome to grandmother's house, bitch. <laughs> Chloe, this can't Jeez, be you. Chloe. Apologize this instant. Fine. Mr. Wells, I'm sorry for exposing the flaws in your campus security. This must be very embarrassing for you. Oh, and that must be why they hire her stepdad. I've heard enough. Rachel, you were clearly trying to cover for your classmate. I appreciate the motive, but I appreciate honesty more. Is that understood? Yes, sir. You will not be removed from the play. Was that so hard? Thank you. And Miss Price, I came into today's meeting planning to suspend you for the rest of the school year with a chance for reinstatement in the fall. No chance. And now? You are expelled. What? No. I will have Skip Matthews escort you to clean out your locker. You may wait outside my office until he arrives. Well, we know this is gonna happen. That is all. Good day, Mrs. Price. Mr. and Mrs. Amber. 
Ray. Come on, Chloe. Shit. Whatever. What were you honestly gonna do with your life anyway? <laughs> I'm sorry. Nothing to be sorry about. Meet me at the junkyard later? You bet. I didn't get the chance to introduce myself. I'm Joyce. Mrs. Price. I'm Rose. This is James. I'm sorry we had to meet like this. No, I'm sorry. I'm sure for you this is an unusual circumstance. We really should be going. Nice to meet you. Hey, Skip. <laughs> Mom, I'm... I'll see you. In the parking lot. Shit. Hey, Chloe. I'm supposed to walk you out. Just you and me. Hey, Skip. Fuck them. <laughs> Bunch of fascists. Skip, do you even know what a fascist is? Hey, uh. Just wanted to say. It sucks what is happening to you. Thanks, Skip. You're gonna Skip, be you're missed. Gonna lose your job. I don't really care about any of this shit. Except my secret stash. Might as well grab my emergency joint while I'm here. Photo. Bongo was a stray cat before oh, we rescued Bongo. her. Oh, that's right. Then she got run over by a car. <laughs> Moral of the story, n no one's ever really rescued. That's sad. Wow. We're taking Bongo. Yes, take Bongo. What else do we have? I oh, say so I better not be the only thing I could take. Homework? Trash. Love how every time someone tells me how much potential I have, it's right before saying how I'm wasting it all. One out of 17. Ouch. Go, I need to start seeing more effort from you, or you're going to fail my class. The quality of... Your work lately simply doesn't speak to the amount of potential I see in you. I know you're better than this. Shit. Love how every time some... Garbage. Sorry, Skip. I'm taking my time. <laughs> Trusty keeper of my graffiti pens. You've served me well. I guess you're not allowed to take... Yeah. I had big plans too. for adding to this collage. Oh well. Oh, Chloe. Wonder who will grace this space after me. Oh. Sign your name. Having Justin as my locker neighbor was one of the few not shitty things about this place. Maybe Kim was the class I hated the least. Geometry. If Chloe leaves Blackwell at 11 a.m., going 100 <laughs> miles per hour, how long will it take her to get as far away as fucking possible? That's not geometry. No. I should English. write a poem to mark the occasion. Something with... <laughs> imagery. Absolutely, positively the best concert of 2008. <laughs> Too bad it's time to go. Yeah. You okay? I scratched up my plastic wrap. Look at Remington in the window. He's, He's so cute. cute. Finally, what I actually came here for.
Jackpot. Awkward. <laughs> Wait. What the hell? Damn it, Justin. Damn it, Justin. Damn it, Justin. Fuck every inch of this place. I wish I could tag it from floor to ceiling. But with Skip watching me... Uh, bathroom. Then I'm out. Cool? <sighs> okay. But try to make it fast, will you? Later, Skip. Later. Bye, Skip. Mm -hmm. Oh, dear. Looks like David's here. I thought that was your phone. <laughs> it was Chloe's phone. No, I thought it was like your no. phone, though. <laughs> You're hella weird. You are. Seriously, it's okay. Yesterday was worth it. Probably worth it. Probably worth it. Wii U is in the way. Mm -hmm. The Nintendo brick is in the way. You know what doesn't suck? What? You. You also don't suck. God. They're texting at like 1 o'clock in the morning. Oh, how do I feel? <laughs> my house without seeing either of my parents. Sweet. You were born to be a spy, jumping on trains and shit. Oh man, we make such a great team. No enemy viewfinder would ever be safe from you again. <laughs> Meanwhile, you're deep undercover as a passed out person. LOL, today was unforgettable. Some of it sucked. Yeah. You know what doesn't suck? What? You. You also don't suck. I know. We should probably sleep. Got bells tomorrow morning. Yeah. My fault. Worth it. Wells blows. That meaning hella sucks. You're hella weird. You are. Seriously, it's okay. I guess it was worth it. <laughs> Who's Elliot? 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 Who's Elliot
I do not respond to my mom. Will you be joining us for supper? No thanks. Will you be coming home at some point tonight? Chloe, will you be home by curfew? There will be consequences. Glad we talked. Me too. I know you're doing your best. Love you. Your school called. I think they, I think you know why. We have a meeting tomorrow with Principal Wells. I need you to do better. Chloe, 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 I'm worried about you. Please let me know you're okay. Chloe, did you hear there's a fire? Please text me so I don't worry. Chloe, are you okay? Chloe, please. I'm fine. Okay, thank goodness. Come by a curfew. We have that meeting early tomorrow again. Chloe, really? Chloe, you can't keep doing this to me. I'm trying my best. Shit. I hope you already read these, but whatever. Mm -hmm. Spanish text. Spanish test sucked. Lucky if I passed. Aw, uh, lo siento. No, I think I did okay. Cool. What are you up to? Not much, got shit to do later. Oh, okay, you finished the chem homework? Nope. Dude, that's the third time. I already know everything. Hey, why weren't you in, in chem? Everything okay? Yep. What happened with Drew? People saying you were awesome. Yo, let's talk later. Okay. Holy shit, did you get Will's text about the fire? Are you okay? Will's texts, you guys? I guess so. Yeah, you? Yeah, I'm just in my room. Hey, after Tempest, you wanna hang out? Tell me your boyfriend. I think he's trying to get away. Urgent, the fire weather update. Arcadia Bay Forest Watch, Arcadia Bay, OR 0202 AM PST set, May 8th, 2010. Holy shit. Active Class D wildfire, not contained. Use caution, check local media for road closures. Shit. Principal Wells. Members of the Black Lock community, please be advised that fast moving wildfire has recently been sighted in the vicinity of Culmination State Park. I have spoken with Acadia Bay Forest Watch, who do not believe any evacuations are necessary at this time, as the Blackwell campus is not within the affected area or the fire's current projected path. Please utilize caution while traveling to and from campus. Faculty and staff have been asked to waive punctuality requirements for all sports and extracurricular activities this weekend. Awesome. Oh, she didn't say the last part. Oh, sugar. Drugs are free here. <laughs> Man, why didn't anyone tell me before? Mm. If you're, you were within 1,000 feet, <laughs> if you were within one mile yep. of a drug free zone, is that what it is? 100 feet to a mile? Or is it 100 meters? It's 100 feet. meters to a mile. No feet. Are you sure? Yes. Because a mile is American, kilometers are meters, because it's Canadian. Or, not really Canadian, but... Is it? Imperial in metric, yes. Maybe they'll use my scholarship money to finally fix this pothole. I guess these stage lights are for the Tempest. Well, that's right, but PR whenever I thing. needed to bum one, no one here smokes. No one Fuck here Fuck this smokes. place. How many nautical... How many nautical miles? I guess miles? this fire is no joke. Still can't believe Rachel started it. Due to for forest fire in the area, Katie Bay is on high fire safety alert. Know your role, run and respond to fire alarms immediately in an orderly fashion to review your emergency exit locations in school and at home discuss emergency protocol with parents and guardians. Do your part to help keep Arcadia Bay safe. Oh my god, we just want to keep eating chocolate. We're going for supper. Elliot and I have gone to school together yeah, since we were in kindergarten until today. What is it? Snickers. Apparently there's supposed to be Mars in this box. Hey, Elliot. <laughs> What brings Chloe Price to school on a Saturday morning? Nothing good, I bet. I was expelled. Wait, really? Holy shit! I know. I'm surprised it took this long, too. Do you want a hug? No. Do not hug Let's him. not make a big deal out of this. Oh, sorry. Right, yeah. Was Rachel Amber involved? Yeah. And let me guess, did she get off scot-free? Well, yeah. But she tried to cover for me. 
Uh-huh. Anyway, what are you doing here? I thought I should come early to grab tickets. For the Tempest? You said we might see it together. Oh, no, I'm just kidding. Right. Good call. Did you get my text about hanging out afterwards? Sorry, Elliot, but I'm probably going to hang out with Rachel. You know, post-show celebration and whatever. Oh, cool. That makes sense. I better go. Uh, my mom is waiting to sick her attack mustache on me. Her boyfriend. Uh, don't worry about it. See you around, Elliot. Sorry, Elliot, you just got friend zone. Yeah. Later. Get back on your cell phone. Text someone who cares. This car. Is it Wells' car? His head much? That has to be Skip's car. Deadbeat <laughs> babies. Definitely Skip's car. Get this sticker. My other vehicle is drama. <laughs> <laughs> Who is that? Did I already see this notice? I don't know if you looked at it. Max would have loved this shit. The future needs excellence. Because of a generous grant from the Pre Prescott Foundation, Blackwells will be offering several new courses next fall designed to nurture the artistic gifts of its students. Visual concepts, Ooh. intro to composition, intro to ceramics. Sorry, oh, oh, immediate Photoshop or intermediate Photoshop, intro to what? character modeling and animation, what? photography, independent study by invitation only. Special thanks to Caroline Prescott. Fuck the Prescotts. I want to do all of those things. They're the ones who brought in. Um, yeah, they got Max. And uh, oh my God. Three guesses whose bike this is, and they all start with Miss Grant. Yeah, I guess I will miss one thing about this place. Don't use me. Don't make me use my teacher voice. Wells's car, crushing spirits, must pay pretty well. <laughs> taking pride in Blackwell Athletics means taking pride in yourself. Also, the trustees and their enormous bank accounts. Through that girl. Random particles just floating out from the middle of nowhere. Uh, okay. Yeah. Bye. <laughs> <Latest> Blackwell bird. <laughs> um, bye. Okay, uh, bye. <laughs> bye. <laughs> Chloe's so cute. Latest Blackwell bird. We still have a. Uh, Plenty of free time to take up skateboarding again. If I feel like it. You have to get a job, you bum. Mm -hmm. You gotta help support your fam. It's about damn time. David, Oops. please. That's what they do best here at Blackwell. Empty things out and toss them Just aside. Pick one up and toss one at David. Yes. Mom is clearly fighting to hide her disappointment. Which, of course... Just makes this worse. Get Chloe, my face, David. Your mother and I have been talking. I don't care. Can we please do this later? Can we do this later? I don't think I can handle another fight right now. And who do you expect to handle things for you? Your mother? I don't need a conversation. Not with Sergeant Asshat here. I just need some space. Do not use that language with your mother. Fuck you. <laughs> or what? Or what, David? What will you do? You do not want to test me. Yeah. Maybe if you try listening to me, instead of fighting me about everything, you might actually learn a thing or two. Yeah. What? Or I could just... Like how to have no job? Or how to be a soldier? Soldiers put family and future above self and now. 
Getting kicked out of school? That's what losers do. Whoa. You had a scholarship, Chloe. Do you know what that means? What kind of opportunity you gave up? Do you want to work at the diner? There's nothing wrong with that. So There's nothing wrong with waiting tables, Mom. Chloe, I'm proud to wait tables because it means you can be whatever you want to be. But what is that, Chloe? What do you want? Maybe... I don't want to be standing here being condescended to. I don't know yet. Maybe you've had long enough to figure it out. Maybe you should put some right now, makeup on your Right now, what I need mom. most of all <laughs> is for the two of you to start getting along. Oh, well, they'll never have Chloe, I yeah. care about Joyce very much. I'm willing to forgive you for the incident yesterday. What happened yesterday? If you improve your attitude going forward. Incident? Oh, All my what fault, incident? Is it? I'll just say it doesn't even hurt anymore. we had a rather frank discussion. But with an apology, I'm willing to start over. I said it doesn't hurt anymore. I know, but I feel like I'm hurting. Oh, you're not. I would keep doing it if sure. it hurt. Reset button pressed. I am glad to hear it. From now I'm on, not. I will be I assisting your mother in a few areas. Like making sure that you are no longer abusing drugs or alcohol. Oh, God. Jesus. Mom. Chloe, I'd like you to empty your pockets and place all your belongings on the trunk of the car. <laughs> what the I fuck? I think fucking not. If we are going to start over, we have to know that you are not abusing drugs. If you're not, you should be eager for the chance to prove it. Mom. I don't need more discipline from you. I need my mom. I know, Chloe. And I'm sorry, but David feels... Joyce. We feel this is the best way to start fresh. Oh, well, Let's about go, five. Chloe. Yeah. Quit stalling. Oh. Pointing? No, just walk away, Chloe. Just... Refuse. Yeah, I'm not gonna do that. You think I'm guilty? Sure. Here you go. Show me a warrant, asshole. <laughs> you watch too much television. Your refusal to comply is as good as an admission. I admit to you being a fascist, and I don't take orders from fascists. I'll walk home, bye. What happened yeah. to trust being a two-way street? Yes. That was before you were expelled. Shit, my mom hates me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Somewhere along the way, we lost our trust. This is not the way to get it back. Not at all. Okay. That's it? She's basically admitted her guilt, and you're letting her off the hook? I am not letting her off the hook. I am trying to find a way for us to move on. We need a new beginning. A new chapter. One that will involve the three of us together. W what does that mean? We both agree that the best thing for everyone at this stage is for me to move in. Shit. Sick, bye, I'm moving out. No yeah. fucking way. Chloe, after everything that's happened, uh, I'm at a loss. I need help. Exactly. We need a firmer hand steering this ship. Talk to Whoa. me, Chloe. Tell me what you're feeling. Um, pissed is a good place to start. Yeah. Betrayed is a good second. Trying, I get it. Yeah, I know I fucked up. I'm trying, I get it. You're trying. I get it. I, I swear, I do. And I've been making it harder for you. But this is not the answer. It's the only answer I have, Chloe. In a million years, I never thought you'd choose David over me. I'm sorry I took that for granted. I'm not choosing anyone over anyone else. It's about the three of us having a home together. It'll be better than you think, Chloe. Once everything's running smoothly, 
You'll see what a stable home can be like. I had one before my dad died. Exactly. Just slam the door and walk off. Can you? Is it gonna be a choice? I don't know. There is no home. Not if he's there. Sick. Yes. <laughs> Chloe. Let her go. She'll come home as soon as her tantrum is over. way is up when your whole life has been turned upside down. Are you? Check your... Oh. Black Hole's done with me. I can't go home anymore. I live in the junkyard. I am the junkyard. Yes. We in the junkyard. Is this junkyard all I've got left? The first in the background. This beast will ever run. Such a tool. Oh God! Shit. Maybe I need my daughter back. And again, the first thing it needs is a new battery. All right. Let's Wonder if battery. I can find one around here. Here's a bat. Three. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm all smashed out. For now. I've never smashed. <laughs> well, that's cute. Get battery. Put in truck. <laughs> I have a girl written on my hand. Do you? Mm -hmm. From what? From yesterday when I had garlic rub. Oh, I see. No. Not going over there. Mm -hmm. Might need a tetanus shot. Like several tetanus shots. This is in America, so that's shit ain't free. Yeah, no coverage. Leave this? no trash box unopened. That's my motto. No trash box. <laughs> it's gonna be a head in there. Hopefully. Oh, a bobblehead. A bobblehead. <laughs> Close enough. 
You just stuck a bobblehead in your pocket? Yeah, I did. A mannequin head. Guess I was pretty pissed at Rachel last night. Amazing that someone I just met could have made me this angry. Shit. Girl's got anger issues. Rachel Amber has bipolar disorder. Yeah, she is. Max and I used to go there all the time as kids. I think it shut down, but who knows? Check the magic school bus. I guess I'll never ride one of these again. That's so. I mean, you're not missing much. Awesome. Beach town. You're a long way from the beach. Yes, it is. It's not that we can take bubblehead, but not anything else. I know. Don't tell me what to do. <laughs> yeah, okay. Bye. Don't tell me what to do. I always wanted a pet snake. Instead, I got David. Fuck everything. More snake than a snake is. Mm -hmm. Snakes have bad reps. I love snakes. Of being like, do not trust. Here's oh, the nice. side of Arcadia Bay they don't put on the postcards. You stab. Oh, a truck. This thing this looks thing somewhat is. new. Mm -hmm. Maybe the battery still works? Probably. What are you trying to hide under there, Hood? Go inside, pull the thing. Yeah, pop the hood. Oh, it's right there. <laughs> Oh, they show it. Oh, what is this? Wow. <laughs> Shitty ride, drug dealer. Really thought crime paid better. This vehicle has been seized and impounded in execution of a warrant order. This vehicle was detained and impounded in accordance with the authority provided by the Rule 42 of the Oregon Magistrate's Court Rules in the pursuance of Section 2.1 of the Narcotics Damage Act of 1985. It is an offense, too, without lawful excuse to destroy, destroy, damage, or tamper with this property. Heh, <laughs> <laughs> fuck that shit, I'm gonna take the battery. They totally destroyed it. Pull the latch. Pull the latch. Yeah, yeah. Remington! Get down, peepers. In official car speak. This is the thing that makes the other things do their things. Yes, you're not lovely. wrong. I'm not done exploring yet. So Here we go. The pick of the litter. I'm just sweating through this. I just want to take it off. Not yet. I used to love opening up the gotta... diner with mom before school. I guess those days are now officially over. Two whales diner. I'm a whale. Little tail? No, this this mat has seen Mark some not. things. <laughs> Mostly feet. The crab shack. Crab shack. Mm, crab shack. Mm, I don't like crabs, I don't think. Mm, I don't want to leave yet. Sorry, Chloe. Oh, poor Ragnarok has 98% of Rotten Tomatoes. Wow. American Rust. Sounds about right. When did it come out? Not out yet, right? It's out November, I do believe. Maybe sure. mm -hmm. like previewing all the uh, DMCs. Mm -hmm. Toy Robot. Robot. It's all fun and games till this guy enslaves everyone. Oh, Chloe. So, what did you need the bobblehead for? I'm going to put it in my car. Or in my truck, because eventually. She is a bubble head in the truck. Yes. Oh, 
him again. Up next, a local band called Pisshead is blowing mines and speakers throughout the bay. Here's their new single, Nothing Wrong. Grabbed up pirate flag. Pretty real. Yeah. Okay. Oh. A pirate flag? Wonder if there's treasure buried nearby. <laughs> Now I've put on this popular music, <laughs> my YouTube videos to get flagged. I know one fire that doesn't need any poking. Uh-oh. Now this is a Vortex Club, I wouldn't mind joining. But Cassidy Knight, probably does an atheism pretty well. The Motley Ball, mm -hmm. Fuck off to Reagan, he's a pussy breed. That's all kind of classic 81. Yeah. This is like. Got another place where even Christmas looks depressing. Yeah. It's so pretty. A rug. This rug has some miles on it. Alright, I think I'm done exploring. Camera. Sorry, Max. I think I'm more jealous of you than anything. Hopefully, I'll be escaping this place soon, too. No, you're stuck here forever, Chloe. Yeah. <laughs> but then you come back to life. Only to die again or to be saved. Who mm -hmm. knows? Spoiler alert. Oh yeah, right. Spoiler alert, I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. Remington! Stop! He's so I gotta go hit that child. He's so annoying. Oh. Get down! Let's close the window. Lord, oh, no, it's not <laughs> I'm gonna open this one so that if you do bad shit again, I can whack it easier. I'm so excited to buy sweaters tomorrow. The F21 has some good shit. If I don't have anything, I hope they do have some good things. I'm excited just to look. I'm excited to buy tacos for lunch. Tacos. 100%. Taco Bell. Just so you know. I'm aware. Oh my god, is that your key? Yep. Damn. This thing needs more love than I can give right now. In the meantime, maybe I can spruce it up a bit. No, she's gonna draw on it. Oh, I got a text message. Rachel. Chloe Price. I don't suck. You really don't. You really, really don't. My mom thinks I do. Don't know if I can stand going home tonight. Still there? <sighs> Grabbing something from home, then I'll meet you at the Junker and see you really soon. You better. Bye, girl. Bye, batch. <laughs> While an escape hatch could be nice, I should probably I cover the over this massive hole. The mat? Yeah, or the rug. The part probably a good idea to cover over this with something. Or the beach towel. Beach towel and fire flag. Yeah. Broken ball. Did we find a ball. Maybe there's yes. another light bulb I can put in here. It's in the, uh, Snick Aquarium. I know someone who would be very happy here. Man. AKA you can hang Elvis. here, but I get to pick the tunes. Okay? Good talk. <laughs> Wasn't there a. Oh, it was Singing Man. Yeah, singing I man. thought it said sign the thing. Yeah. Grab the shit. Well, you know where pretty much everything is. Okay. Yeah. Let's see what else this trash heap has to offer. Oh, peep. What was wrong with you, Remington? 
Oh, that's my dad's yeah, car. Yeah, that's why she didn't want to go near it. Triggered. Triggered. Hmm. God, don't kill yourself. <laughs> I know Laura Croft, but I tried. Come on, do a chin up, man. <laughs> Damn, you cigarettes. <laughs> Can you put the robot in the truck? Maybe. Heart flag behind you. Yeah. Just find the this might make the perfect cover for that torn seat. Yeah, really, you can put it in your pocket with that? Yep. Yeah, you can take a bulb out of the green. You're a long yes. way from the country club, guy. For or something. Oh, it's gonna cover up the hole on the floor. You just got the map. Oh well, now I got a putting green. <laughs> and the Christmas wreath can give you the light for the top. That's true. AC. Shush. Here's hoping for a holiday miracle to light up my ride. What did he eat last? I don't know. Holy shit, these things are huge. Yeah, they are. Take up the side of your screen. Yeah, they are. What else do I need? I think that's it. You got everything. Better head back. Oh well, I'm already there. Huh? Exactly. Like, shut up, Chloe. Did you ever get a ride in her truck? Oh, okay. There was all this shit. This thing looks like a rusted out shopping cart. It probably drives like one too. That's if it ever does drive, which seems questionable. Still, how sweet would that be? Frank, what's up? Yeah, just checking in to see how you're doing. Really? No. Listen, we've got some business to discuss. Where can we meet? What about... Oh, like... drugs? Price. I'm hanging out in the junkyard, north of town. The junkyard, that's great. Stay there, I'll see you soon. Okay. And, Frank... Cool. Yeah. I'm not in trouble or anything, right? I don't know. Did you do anything you should be in trouble for? <laughs> like, in general? Or to you? I'll see you soon. Shit, Frank's gonna kill me. No, he's not. <laughs> Seven years ago, flip phones were a thing? Yeah. Definitely. Time for a hard-earned smoke break. The inaugural truck tag. 
You only get one chance to make a first expression. <laughs> um, mystical, frightening, frightening. I'm glad that Sharpie works and squeaks on everything. <laughs> the <laughs> eye sees all. Feels on wheels. <laughs> Does your truck look like a Christmas party on wheels? <laughs> yeah, didn't think so. And the birds are gonna take off. Can you go into the for me? Yeah, I'm just Does Principal Wells eat pizza with a fork and knife? <laughs> I knew there was something off about that guy. <laughs> what do we have here? Ownership. Most people probably wouldn't wear a beanie they found in a junkyard. <laughs> Sucks for most people. Ew. Oh, well. Yep. This'll do. Is that the one you wear? I think so. I guess this is only three episodes long. Yeah. Fixing the truck was hard work. Time to kick back and light up when I'm done looking around. In my own time, I'm trying to reach out. I'm Why you think you are? Now they put it in my head, I think I am. It just is two very extreme things that you've never done before. All in a matter of two weeks. Life crisis really kicks in. And you're like, shit. Not even in the middle of my life. <laughs> I'm like, barely over a quarter of my life. <laughs> oh, this thing. I don't like it. I just wanted to come off. Yeah. Uh -oh. Shit. Driven. I slept all day. My little doodle Ooh. in the background is moving. What the hell? Rachel Amber, you're dreaming. Being Chloe. Uh oh. My dad's car's on fire. And my dad's sitting in front of it with a raven and roasting marshmallows. Sick. Alright, come on, boys. Who do you think is going to wake you up? I'm going to say Frank. What are we doing now? There's like weird screaming in the background too. Yes, there is. I wonder if it burned like this the day... The day 
it happen. Do I feel like roasting a marshmallow? Yes. You're not going to talk to your father? Hold on a second. There's a marshmallow. Stab. Do I even like marshmallows? No one does, but it's just fun <laughs> to do. That's life. I miss him so much. Dad, what are we doing here? <laughs> Speak to him again. Uh, are you trying to tell me something? When life gives you lemons. The fire coming closer. If you start a fire, sometimes the only thing you can do is roast a marshmallow. Yeah. Or I guess if your weird bipolar girlfriend sets a tree on fire because she's really mad that her dad's cheating, sometimes all you can do is roast a marshmallow. Mm -hmm. And then it travels down the stick and burns Chloe to a crisp. Amazing, isn't it? I can't look away. What? Sure. Don't pretend you're not mesmerized, too. See? You're so drawn to it, you don't even realize the danger. There you go. There's your lesson. Yeah. Danger? When your girlfriend's fire a trash blinds fire. Us. Just like darkness. But darkness blinds with absence. With loss. What does fire blind with? Light. Beauty. Light. Uh. Whoa. Shit. But sometimes, there's a greater beauty yet to come. Incredible. Fire is Chloe. jealous, Chloe. It wants all the beauty rooms. for itself. That's why you need to be careful. Careful of what? Rachel. Oh, Whoa. Shit. Of getting burned. Ah. Oh, fuck. You don't need that. Did Pete eat anything? Yeah, he a little bit. He waits because he knows that Jet doesn't eat his. Yeah. Or all of his, I guess. Mm -hmm. So then he'll eat what remains. No, 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 no. Eat your own food. I don't pay no $60 for you to munch on it. Hasn't anyone ever told you not to fall asleep with a lit cigarette? You could start a fire. You're one in top? Yeah. So, are you gonna invite me in? Or what? Not sure. You always know, say not sure. Well, it's your name, you can do what you want. I don't know. I don't know. I'm not supposed I'm not to give rides to that. strangers. What if I promise you free candy? Hop in. <laughs> Where's 
Rachel, are you moving out? It's <laughs> true. It's like my truck don't start, so we're gonna live in my truck. Damn, you've been busy. It's nothing. Just some junk I found lying around. A uh, pirate flag? A uh, bright green light? Holy shit. The all-seeing eye. <laughs> Figured it can't hurt to have the Illuminati on our side for whenever shit goes down. <laughs> Always thinking yeah, ahead. <laughs> Chloe, this is incredible. I, I can't believe you found us an escape vehicle already. <laughs> like, for us to run away? Oh, I, I guess I wasn't thinking about it that way. Are you getting cold feet? I thought you were all bye-bye Arcadia Bay last night. I still am. I oh, guess. Sorry. You guess? Ugh. It's not so Leave easy. Me alone, you bipolar bitch. This truck doesn't even <laughs> start, Jesus. and we don't have any money. We can figure money. all of that out. I have no doubt. Besides, there's no rush. True. And no Blackwell. <sighs> Holy shit. <laughs> that Wells meeting. I'm so sorry. I can't believe he actually expelled you. Why not? No reason to prolong the inevitable. It's definitely Blackwell's loss. You covering for me was amazing. I don't know how to thank you. <sighs> Whatever. You tried to cover for me too. Tried and failed. <laughs> I guess we know who the better liar is. Or maybe my lie was the one he wanted to believe. At least Wells has no idea what really went down with us last night. Shit got pretty wild. All because of you, girl. Rachel, that was more than pretty wild. You went absolutely <laughs> nuts last night. What the hell were you thinking? I was angry. I didn't expect the whole stupid park to go whoosh. But <laughs> now you're in on it too. Accessory after the fact. Unless you tell on me, of course. I'm no snitch. I'd be way happier going to jail than having to live at home with Dick Tater David. He announced his plans to move in this morning. Oh, Chloe, that's awful. I'm so sorry. You know what we both could use? Therapy. Therapy. You start. Kick back and tell me what's bothering you. Lots of things. <laughs> oh my god, just bang already. <laughs> Jesus Man, Christ. Well, We've well, known each other for two days. Yeah, well. Last time. There's this <laughs> dildo with a mustache who's been dating my mom, and now he thinks <sighs> he's moving in with us. How do I stop him? Hmm, that's a hard one. I'm not sure there's really anything you can do. Then what the hell am I talking to you for? <laughs> Just because you can't stop him doesn't mean you don't fight back. The resistance begins now. All right. You're going to need a new nickname to mark your enemy. What have you got? Step, step douche. douche. He's, uh, step douche. Because he's inserting himself where he doesn't belong. <laughs> also, he's a douche. Poetic. May I also suggest step ladder? Why step ladder? Because. He climbs on your mom every night. Ew! Ew. And pretty soon, they'll <laughs> be stepping down the aisle. What the hell kind of therapist are you? Sorry. It's called shock therapy. Highly controversial. <laughs> so, my new friend, who everyone mm. thinks is perfect, did something batshit fucking nutso last night. What do I do? This perfect friend of yours, who I'm assuming is also an exceptional beauty, sounds like she may have been inspired by someone new in her life. Someone who is also, may I add, a knockout in the looks department. Perhaps this friend of yours, who I reiterate must be just stunning, 
needed someone in her life to teach her. How to break into a viewfinder? How not to give a fuck. Because she was tired of having to give so many fucks all the time. That makes sense. I've been booted from school, and I'm not entirely sure what to do about it. You mean how to cope with your feelings of anger and disappointment? No. I mean how to express my feelings <laughs> of intense joy. It's a little too well. You tell me. I'd say I'm exceptionally well-adjusted. I bet my and, uh, therapist's license Rachel? that no one's ever called you that before. <laughs> not here. <laughs> not here. Touche, <laughs> Doc. That was actually somewhat therapeutic. Thank you. It's always a pleasure delving into the mind of Chloe Price. And now it's your turn. Tell me all about what it's like being daughter of Arcadia Bay's most famous scumbag. It sucks. Great, Chloe. Good Too job. Blunt? Sorry. I do that sometimes. Nah, I'm just... Ugh, I don't know. <laughs> yes. You used to Can do we that talk to about me, something Cheryl. else? Yeah? Yeah. And look where we are Of now. course. You're going through a midlife crisis. I am not going through a <laughs> midlife crisis! I'm just kidding. I'm not even in hey. the middle you of You ever try life. picturing what Principal Wells does when he's not at school? I see, Drinks. like, a yes. bed covered in teddy bears, and he's tying a little necktie around each one. That's <laughs> weird. I'm a weirdo. Should be you feed the boys this morning before you left? Yes. Okay. They're very annoying. Do you think there's a point when you've been acting so much that you don't even have your own personality anymore? You're yeah. just whatever you think other people want you to be. I think you have a personality. I wasn't talking about me. My dad doesn't really exist. You saw him in Wells' office. The whole thing is a performance. And now I'm starting to feel like everything in my life is bullshit. But he's breathe. still my dad. Rachel, How can I make sure I don't end up like him? You need to go to therapy. You're not like him. You couldn't be like him even if you, you wanted can't to. Do this. You're too I awesome. Let you. The fact that you believe that makes me feel better. Shit. It's time for the play. As if my life didn't have enough drama in it. Good luck. Let's go. You know you're never supposed to tell an actor good luck before a show? It's bad luck. How is yeah. telling someone good luck bad luck? You're supposed to say, break a leg. That's dumb. <laughs> hey, I, I was thinking that after the show, maybe we could go do something. Just you and me. Something criminal? Criminally fun. Yes, please. <laughs> I'm in. Wait, you forgot your bag. It's for you. Just a little survival kit for your new life on the lamb. Drive safe, Chloe. It's gonna be closed and shampoo. Mm -hmm. Bye. <laughs> Love you, Rachel Amber. Yes. Pity that you died. Look down. Do it again. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, jump shot. What's taking Frank so long? <laughs> <laughs> Time to check out Rachel Amber's mystery bag. Yeah, I rolled a one against Will. <laughs> Get it? Steph says you're a nerd. Whatever, Mikey. Blow <laughs> Oh, 
It's time to talk about the elephant in the room. This elephant fucking rules. This place is the cutting edge in junkyard security technology. Yes, I need those. Like, on your door. Oh yeah, that's right. That's in six and ten. <laughs> Nothing like an abandoned shack in the middle of a junkyard to make a girl feel like exploring a new wardrobe. The woman we saw with Rachel's dad. She has like a tattoo, like I'll get in the future. Mm -hmm. Flowers. Yo, Frank. It's Chloe. <coughs> Remington. Where's Pompadour? I don't know the secret password, man. Is the password drugs? Price, get your ass in here. Oh, Frank. He knows that guy that you stole that money from. <laughs> Dude! It smells like piss well, in here. Pretty neat Shut here. up. You have a rough night or something? No, Every night's a rough normal. night. I've got a notebook in the back somewhere. Go get it for me, would you? Who is that? What? Ah! God. Jeez, man. <laughs> Get my notebook price. Then we'll talk. Now I'm fetching things for Frank. How low can I go? You got a text from someone? Did I? Yeah. Wait, are you? Are you? Like, in the game. Like, someone texted Chloe. 
just anxious. <laughs> Thanks. Dude, I heard you got expelled. Bad news. You mean good news? I'm stoked. Word. If you want to blaze with me and Trev, let me know. Thanks. Thanks, Brad. Fight the power. It's a nasty one, all right. We're gonna search and see your love. <laughs> oh, Remington. <laughs> your guide to understand the search warrants and how to protect your assets. It's always hard to tell what Frank's thinking. Drugs, drugs, drugs. Next set of drugs. A betting slip. Twelve hundred dollars? Way out of my league. We lost twelve hundred dollars. Yeah. Damon. So Frank's a fellow survivor of Black Hell. Who knew? Sorry, Frank. I didn't know it was your RV when I wrote that. Ugh, gross. I think so. Bomb sauce. For the man who enjoys searing pain with his dragon. <laughs> what does Frank really need to remember? Beer TV and milk. Oh, work. Got it. The Sharpie is like. Everything. I'm dying. That too. A real house. Oh, fuck. Sad. Wish list. What's the French? Apparently, Frank is a werewolf. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently, Frank is a werewolf. <laughs> Sounds familiar. Wait, Frank got a puppy? For real? Have accidents when they are scared to have some. Expert. Hi there, my dog is three months old and he's still peeing everywhere. What do I do? Thanks, Frank. Puppies have accidents when they're scared. You have to stop scolding your puppy. Thanks, but I don't scold him. Then why? Then why is she having accidents? Raising a puppy requires patience, and you cannot control yourself. Please look deeply and honestly at whether you are really able to have a dog. What's your fucking problem, lady? I said I don't scold him. <laughs> well, there's no need to swear. I think it's pretty clear now that you do scold her and worse. Ah, <laughs> oh, man. Rachel the therapist would have a field day with this. 910, about Cloud Moon, 902, what age will dog eat steak? 858, piss head music, 734, Milakuna single. Is this his like search history? I think Cloud so. Screensaver property insurance, yes, fire, Arcadia Bay, Forest Watch. Megan Fox single. Uh, How large was Biggest Cloud in history? <laughs> Why won't Puppy eat steak? Jeez. That's an expensive dog. Hold well, on, you missed one. Do I have one? Yes. Oh, never mind. Uh, ball crusher. Uh, fucking shit. Frank, I went back to the mill. Shouldn't have. I'm fucking furious. Everything's burned. Total massacre. Shit. Can't stop thinking about it. Dogs didn't make it. That's 10k gone just like that. Plus the stud fees we got coming. RF and that whole crew are gonna be pissed. How am I supposed to come back from this with my fucking reputation intact? I can't think straight on this shit right now. I just want to find who started the fire and burn his fucking face. Shit. Huh? So those dogs at the very beginning died? What dogs? Pardon? What dogs? There's two dogs tied to the camper outside the mill when I went to the concert. Was there? Yeah. I don't remember. Frank, you like a dog? I thought you would. Dog is special, man. Callie's buyer wanted him, and I said, fuck off, keep your 3k, I'm saving it for my buddy Frank. I mean it, everything you've done for me adds up way more than 3k, don't thank me, this is for me to you, just let me breed him later, Damon. Yeah, take a shit. I guess Frank subscribes to the hiding in plain sight philosophy of drug stashing. Don't take his shit. <laughs> Part of a balanced breakfast. Um, this shit should be refrigerated. Don't yes. mind if I do. Don't even fucking think about it. Damn. <laughs> Sorry, Frank. Do I really want to see Frank's bedroom? Yeah. 
Yeah, I do. 